My bad. I got my time mixed up, man. I had my time all backwards, dog. I'm over here thinking the game started at 7.30 my time. Bro, the Capella really just missed that layup, bro. What's good with y'all, though? 10-9 <clears throat> Hawks. Your boy is late. My dad for that. Huh. We should beat these dudes, man. I ain't going much lie to you. Hunter no good. Man, look at this. Look at this team for him. We ain't got nobody for real, for real. <clears throat> Going the other way. What's good, family? Salute everybody in the building, man. Salute, salute, salute. Your boy is late to the show. I am sorry about that. My bad but as you can see the hawks 10 9 early 748 left to go yeah dre clint murray back to clint back to murray tried to go back to clint but good defense by charlotte they read that like a book mm. Mm. And we are losing 12-10. Nice shot by Dre Hunter to tie the game up. <clears throat> we got 13 game. Ah, uh, nice look. I'm out. Hawk oh, struggling. <sighs> we are not, man, come on. We got to get some going, boys. This is not an exciting game to watch. Not exciting at all. <clears throat> And I was planning on watching this game, man. I was sitting back, and I'm like, okay, 7.30, tip. I forgot that was 7.30 Eastern time. I was like, man, geez. But I still, we still going gonna to knock out this post-game live show, man. I'm just getting back in my routine, man. Getting back in the routine of things. Watching these dudes. Damn, I got to still... What's good, Daniel? What's poppin'? Salute to the homeboy, Daniel, man. Salute to the homie. Is the Hawks struggling to get Charlotte? But that, that's to be expected. We can't beat Charlotte. Don't matter. It don't matter who on their team. It don't matter who we have. We find a way to lose to the Hawks. I don't know why. I don't know how. But it happens. As Brooklyn lost again today. They definitely trying to get the, that top five lottery pick. What's good with y'all though, man? How's y'all uh how's y'all weekend going already, man? Hope everybody having a good weekend. Nice Saturday. Hope y'all out and about doing things with your family, doing things just if you're single, doing things if you're young, going out, having a good time. Don't waste your time stressing over this team, man. These dudes ain't trying to win. 
dudes are not trying to win. I don't know what dress, what the heck dress Tabitha got on today. Come on, Tabitha, you gotta spice that up, bro. Our sideline reporter, you gotta spice that up. That little outfit she got on, you gotta spice that up. Put some accessories with it or something. Just the little polka dots ain't it. That's like, that's like 90s. You gotta spice up that fit, Miss Ma'am. Okay, we're back to the action. Let's see what Murray got cooking. They go to vet. Uh-huh. Hunter. Air ball. I ain't gonna front, man. People talking about Murray, man, not living up to what we traded for. Hunter definitely ain't lived up to what uh Hunter's definitely not lived up to nothing, bro. Complete disappointment, man. A complete disappointment from Dre Hunter, man. Cash for Garrison Matthews. Cash money, baby. Cash money. Hawks down one. Mm -hmm. Out of bounds. I'm surprised people even went to the game today. They must have got nothing else to do. <laughs> you call me the fashion police? <laughs> I'm just saying, man, that fits. You got to spice that up, man. You're going to be our sideline reporter, man. You got to come better than little, them little polka dots. That ain't it. Feel me? Oh, hey, hey, mom. Oh, I love you too. Doesn't sleep. Corner three, contested. No good. Rebound, Murray. Murray on the push. We get from Matthews, baseline Hunter. No, no foul on the contact. Rebound Bruno. They swing it back out. Murray at the top. Big jab step. Pull it back. Pass back to Bruno. Murray tried to drop it back down. Kick ball. Reset. Shot clock reset to 14. Okay, inbound Murray, Hunter. Vet to Hunter, Hunter in the lane. Garrison to three. No good. Nice look. And they foul. Sixteen fifteen, man. This is a struggle fest tonight. <laughs> struggle fest right now, man. Struggle fest. And the Hornets set the line shooting two. He hit the first one. Hawks down two. Hawks only with fifteen points so far in the first quarter. And he hits both Hawks down 18-15. Yeah, Murray to Vic, back to Murray. Screen right by Bruno. Bruno rolled and dropped it to Bruno. Spin move up and under at the basket. Nice move by Bruno with a nice finish. That's a nice move. Nice footwork by Bruno Fernando right there. Clint definitely can't do that. Looking at the Hawks defense here. Mm -hmm. The rotations. Hawk oh, three wide open. He's short. Nobody there for the board, though. We got Miles Bridges. Murray on the attack. Pull up Mandy from the free throw line. Got it. 2019 uh, Hornets.
Let me go. Your defense could hit. Let me stay with your guy. We're just working with Hunter, working on bridge. Why? Somebody go contest it. Somebody contest. Y'all both looking at each other like y'all didn't know who's supposed to go out there and contest that three. That's insane, bro. That is insane. Hunter and and uh and Bruno, they both stood there looking at each other like, hey, who gonna go out there? You go out there, you going out there, I can go, you go, I go. Like, what are we doing, bro? Like that shit should be automatic. Bro, we look like a rebuilding franchise, right? No much line to you. Got zero free ball attempts. You'll think we was a team rebuilding. They're like, I mean, I know I ain't talking a lot, man, but bro, I'm, I don't know what I don't know what to say, man. I really don't. I really don't know what to say. I mean, we eight games under five hundred. We're struggling against a team, or we're playing a team we can't beat for some reason. No matter who we got on the court, we can't beat the Hornets. I don't know why. You got you got dudes playing, getting minutes tonight. That wants Matthews, Vic, Bruno, maybe not Bruno, but those two. You're not really gonna get no minutes on a good team. Okay, hog side out. Dribble head off to Murray. Murray with a bit. Bit to Garrison. Garrison for three. And he drew contact, got the foul. Bit to, I mean, uh, Matthew set the line shooting three. Steve Clifford want to review that. Say he stuck his leg out. Mm. Ah, such a man. This is just like. This is agony, bro, watching this game. This is agony. And he want to challenge this shit. Come on, Steve Clifford. Are we serious right now? You really want to challenge this? Two teams that ain't going nowhere, bro. Come on, let's hurry up and speed this game along, man. Hold up, guys. I'll be back. Let me go get my charge. My computer about to die. Let me go get my charger, man, while he challenges bull crap. Be right back.
Thank you. I don't even know why Steve Clifford challenged that mess, man. He wasting people's time. Okay, he put the the villain dude in Windler. Okay. Let me see what this guy got. We awful, bro. I ain't doing much fun. I don't even know what defense we in right now. We in something. Okay, the Windler kid with a rebound. Trent to Windler. Stop. At the Trent. Nothing there. Come on, now we're doing a lot. We're doing extra passing now. Overpassing. Bogey with a brick. Bogey got schooled on defense right there. Dressing down to Bruno with the hook. Nice move by Bruno Fernando. Hawks down two. Okay, good defense by Windler. Help force a turnover on Bertans. Okay. We need to beat these dudes so we can know we can beat these guys. I'm tired of losing to the Hornets all the time. Okay, nice assist from uh, 
Bogey to Bruno right there. Clint would have made that shot. Clint would have missed it. Oh, Trent with the steal. Tough finish by Trent. Hawks take the lead 28-26. Come on, defense equaling points right there. Points off turnovers. Like Grant Williams, like he trapped it. There we go. Nice look, Trent, the bogey. End of the first Hawks up 30-28. 30-28, I'm going to keep it real. I didn't think we was going to score this many points <laughs> in the first quarter. The way it was looking. The way it was looking, I didn't think we was going to score this many points. We struggling, bro. It's hard, bro. These some hard times right here, man. We played a bunch of games that don't matter. What's up, Chris? These last games do not matter to us, man. I mean, we pretty much locked in the 10th spot. Brooklyn lost again. I mean, look at the standings, man. Like, we're really just playing for, like, no reason at all, bro. I ain't much lying to you. I ain't even much lying. The Nets had. The Nets have lost six games in a row, bro. D do not try to make that play in, bro. Bro, we actually, we actually gained a game on the Nets. The race to the bottom is on. Now we went in, man. So into the first, Chris. We went in, man. We up by two, 28 to 30, man. It's been a struggle, though. Don't get me wrong. It's been a struggle. Got to get out there, West Matthews. Oh, my God. Crash by Whitler. Whittler with the cash. <laughs> we need we need everybody to hit today. Good hands by West Matthews. Whittler with it. Go back to Whittler. Go back to the young gunner. West Matthews with the brick. Whittler on the board. Oh, he couldn't hold it. I like the energy from the Whittler kid, man. 
I like the energy. Mm. Oh, in and out. That was a nice move by Brandon Williams. Go back to the Whittler kid. Oh, and the Bruno with the off glass Hawks up 35-31. We started to get a little bit of offensive rhythm going on here. It was kind of stagnant at the beginning of the game, man. We get we get some we get we get a little flow going. Let's see here. Bruno trying to get a steal. Get on your man. And he went out there and drew a foul. <laughs> I give him A for effort. Here we go. Swinging around. Good hands by Bogey. Eight seconds left on the shot clock. Come on, Hawks. Let's defend. Let's defend. Let's defend. Good hands by Wes Matthews again. Good defense by the Hawks on that possession. Forced a 24 second shot clock violation. Grant Williams is complaining and crying. Okay, hey, don't worry about it. Hey, focus on the job there, Chris. Hawks up 35-31. Cross court pass to West Matthews. West Matthews throws it back out the bogey, bogey attack. Pull up on a runner, no good. Rebound Hornets. Here they come. Brandon Miller with the rock. Bogey on him. They get a switch. That was too easy. He got the switch, and Bruno had to fade off to get on his man. And Bogey didn't step up. He just fucking stood there. There we go. Bruno with the spin move and one. Where that come from? Where that come from? Bruno with the look at that. Bruno on uh, spin. Oh my God! Where this been at all year? Where this been at all year, dog? Where has this been at all year, Bruno? Oh my days! Oh my days, Bruno! Wow, with the spinner Ruski. Okay, Bruno. Sheesh. Hey, I feel you, Dame. I feel you, man. Hey. As much as I hate, as much as I hate hope, man, I be, I still, I be, I be hoping. I be hoping we can get a miracle to happen, you know. I mean, obviously, I already backcourt. I already know we're gonna go into the play in, man. I know that already. We four games up on Brooklyn. Brooklyn lost six in a row. They're not. They're not gonna catch us. So I mean, I'm just I always got hope, man, that we could do like Miami Heat did, man. Miami Heat got in through the play in, right? They got in. They got in through the play in, man, and got hot during the play in and playoffs. Well, they got hot after we played them. Shoot that, Dylan. Sure. I mean. Why why not us? Why why we can't go into the plan and get some bodies back? You know, we could get some bodies back and um I mean we could put something together and get a run if we can get some bodies back, but I mean we gotta get bodies back. And then when we get a body back, they got to stay healthy. I mean, Double O just came back and he back already injured. I mean, like, let's get real here, man. 
this ain't normal, bro, for a team to be injured like this. It's not normal. One, two, but all these dudes injured at the same time. They need to look, Hulk need to look into uh they need to look into the uh uh the weight, whoever the dude in charge, the fitness guy, whatever they call him, the trainer, they need to look into these dudes. Why are these guys getting all these injuries at the same time? No good about a young dude. Rebound Bruno. Bruno playing big down there. Kicks it out to Matthews for three. In and out. Rebound horn is 39-37. That boy near Richmond have picked up two techs. Well, they call it delay game. That's a that's a tech. That's a, oh, that's a warning. Okay. We got a tie game. Murray back in the game. Murray to Garrison Matthews. Cross court pass to West Matthews. West get the bump, the contact, no call. Can't finish. Rebound Bruno. Murray straight away three. Cash. Cash. From DeJounte Murray. Cash. 39-42 Hawks. The young rook pulls up for the three short. Rebound, Murray. They come the Hawks, trying to extend the lead. Murray stopping on the, on the right side of the court. The wing goes center, pulls up, straightaway three short. Front rimmed it. Rebound, Bruno playing big. Foul. Bruno working that glass hard tonight. He working that glass hard tonight. Good to see the, the bench up cheering him on, CC. Hunter cheering him on. Bruno. I mean, that's just strictly effort right there, man. That's effort Bruno's showing right now. That's effort. We got to find somebody who's going to give us effort like that all the time. That's the key. Well, I mean, Bruno hits the first three throw. And another thing about Bruno, man, and I know I've talked. I'm, angle, I'm the first one to tell you. I know I talked trash about Bruno beginning of the year. But, um, you know, another good thing about Bruno, he's not a liability at the free throw line. Big Crutchy back in the game. He's not a liability at the free throw line. He shoot, well, I think Bruno was 70-something, 70 75% from the free throw line, compared to CC shooting 50. Bruno hits the second one. Bruno, two for two from the line. 44. Excuse me, yeah, 44-39 Hawks, 7-0-1 left to play in the half. From the Hornets, they give it the number 17. Boom, Hunter's on Bridges. Cross-court pass, Bertans for three. No good. Rebound, Murray. Here comes the Hawks, looking to extend the lead again. Can we get, can we get a bucket here? Murray looking. I mean, excuse me, Hunter looking. Cross-court to Garrison in the lane. Contact, drew the foul going to the line. Way to attack the glass, Garrison Matthews. Attack the glass. Attack him. Attack him. <sighs> now I got to order me something to eat.
What's good though, family? What's good, man? <laughs> Shout out to the homeboy King Hustle. He said, my nigga, you are faithful as fuck to them Hawks. You're a real Hawk supporter, yeah, man. I try to, bro, I tell cats, man. I'm a die hard fan, man. I can't help myself, bro. I'm, I, re I really can't help myself, man. Like, I have to watch him. I don't know what it is, bro. I'll try to cut the game off, and then I'll cut it right back on, man. But, I mean, hopefully we can get a dub tonight, man. Get something going, man. I, I still, uh, shout out to homeboy, uh, Tadri. You think we re-sign Vic? Man, <clears throat> I'm going to tell you like this, T, man. I mean, somebody like Vic, he, he's on a two-way contract. So, I mean, why not keep him? Why not keep him? I mean, he don't hurt. He don't hurt the roster. It don't hurt to keep him. It don't hurt to develop the player, you know. So hopefully, you know, you keep a guy like Vic on the two-way and you let him play in College Park all next year. Just get, gain him more confidence, gain him more confidence. Um, so, I mean, he don't really hurt us, man. My my, my, my concern is, um, my concern for the Hawks in the offseason is what is going to be our budget? That's my concern. So, like, until, I mean, I know everybody got their own idea of what we should do, but, you know, that's why I don't, that's why I'm not coming up with no trade scenarios. That's why I'm not coming up with no ideas because at the end of the day, I need to know is the owner going to let us spend this money. If the owner says spend the money, do what it takes to win, then it's a different ball. It's a different outlook then. But as long as, you know, we got to stay out of the salary tax, you know, you go, you have to keep a guy like Vic because he cheap. I think Vic on this two way, I think he's making a million dollars. This year, I mean, we plant, man, listen, I'm telling y'all, man, the key is the owner, man. And I don't care what Landry Field says, that he said that he had the authority to spend whatever. I don't think he does, to be honest. Cash from Hunter. And, but that's just my opinion. I don't know for sure. Landry Field said he does. So, I mean, with him saying that now, I'm looking at him sideways. Well, why are you not spending the money to make the team better then? Still by uh, Murray. Murray cross court to Hunter. Hunter on the attack. Up, finish. No foul? How's that not a foul? Bro, we, we, nobody gets shitting on by the refs more than, more than we do, bro. Nobody does, man. Uh, he, tough move. He missed. Rebound. CC Murray dancing up, swings it back out to Vic. Vic cross court. Garrison fake the three. Spin move back to Vic. Vic in the lane looking. Spin move. Travel. Travel like a shoot the ball, Vic. God, shoot the shit. <laughs> you right there, dog. Shoot over the dude, man. We got to go all in for Brandon Ingram. This is, this is the deal, man. This is the deal. Is this guy even available, baby keto? Is he even available? Remember this, man. When you go after players that's not available, you have to pay more. You're going to give up a lot to get the player that's not available. I'm telling you. That's why we overpaid. That's why you gave up so much to get DeJounte Murray. We're going to do the same thing again. What's the update on Brandon Ingram's uh, knee? Garrison with the runner. What's the update on Brandon Ingram knee, man? If it's an ACL, hell no. Nah. Hell no. Nah. If it's an ACL, you got to let him ride, dog. Because that means he ain't even going to play till next year this time if we lucky. So, I mean, I'm going to tell y'all, man, I'm going to keep it real, man. No bullshit. No trolling. The best thing. You can hope for, right? Is hope that Jalen Johnson, Kobe Bufkin, uh, develop, go up another level, take the game up another level. You hope Mo Gay, I'm hoping Mo Gay, uh, has a great rookie season next year. I mean, that's that's your main hope right there. That's your main hope. I don't think we're gonna keep Sadiq Bay. If you keep Sadiq Bay, who you getting rid of? You got to get off Clint. Unless they end up keeping them. Who knows with this organization? I thought they was going to get rid of Clint last year. They didn't. So with him being the expiring contract, are they going to hold him? Or are they going to trade him before the season? Or wait to the deadline? 
I mean, but like I said, until we spend some money, this is what you're going to get. You're going to get an average team. We're an average team, and we show flashes here and there, 100 for three. No good. We show flashes. That's about it, man. The flashes that we do show is never consistent. Our ball. I mean, we are not uh they had any fool in the preseason. Never again. I would never make a I'd never make a bet on these Hawks in off preseason ever again. Vic Cash. Cash by Vic Cretchy. Like, look at all the dudes we got in civilian and street clothes, man. Look at street, look at all the street clothes over there, man. Do you see all the street clothes over there? And see, I want to go to the Dallas game, but man, I'm not going up there if we ain't got nobody playing for real, for real. So I mean, listen, man. We we in a bad we in a bad spot, man. We in a bad spot. We gotta hope and pray that the owner says, "Hey, spend what do what it takes to win the game." That's what we gotta hope for, man. Without that, we ain't gonna be doing nothing. But we ain't gonna be doing nothing but shedding salary. So I mean. At least we got a lead on this team, though. I was tired, tired of getting beat by these dudes. Here we go. We're back to the action. 55-43. Hawks. Ah, almost had this. Good hands. Turnover, Hawks basketball. Good hands by Murray right there. Good hands. Uh, don't forget, Southside, we also got lit up by uh, Smush Parker, too. I think, it's, I think it was Smush Parker. It was somebody when Melo and Rogier didn't play. Yes, we have lost to the Hornets without Melo and Terry Rogier. So we got 55, 43, 340 left to go in the half. Murray for three from the wing. Cash. Cash for Murray. Looking for a foul. We didn't get that call. Yeah, the offense was struggling uh early. But look, we're gonna we're gonna hit 60 plus points in the half. Good block by Capella. Shot clock violation. Good job by the Atlanta Hawks defense right there. 
Good job by the Hawks defense. And I know people saying, uh, I know people like, man, it's just the Hornets. But you know, my point, my thing is this: what what you what do we know about Hawks on a sixteen to four run in the last three fifty five? What do what do you know about good team? What's a good attribute? Murray for three, no good. What's a good attribute of a good team? Being teams that you're supposed to beat. So uh, the Hornets team, we're supposed to beat this team, right? On paper. So, you know, us beating them, if we can win this game, you know, that's just something we can build off of. Good look, good pass by Vic. And Clint messed that up because he should have went straight up with it. He's too busy doing his fucking face. Go straight up with it and challenge him, Clint. See, look at all this pump faking shit, y'all. Stop doing it. Golly, just go up on him, Clint. It's like Clint's scared of the contact. Like, as soon as he get it, if I was the coach, I would tell Clint, I don't want to see you dribble the ball. I don't want to see you pump faking. Get it and go up with it. Go up with some power and go up with force. Hawks up 60-43. Both get around the Clint screen. Brings it back to Vic. Fakes the three. Attack. Looking. Picked up his dribble. Clint with the contact going to the line. Thank you, Clint. Damn. Stop all that dribbling shit. All that dribbling, all that pump faking, stop doing it. Just go straight up, bro. And I'm trying to get Clint some, uh, trying to give him some grace by saying he injured because he don't have no lift right now. Clint hit the first free throw. He has absolutely no lift. I mean, catch up. I've, I've said that already. I've already called out, like, where is A.J. Griffin? Where he at? But I think, I think now, if I'm not mistaken, I think he's injured. I think he injured. Good take. Good take by the Hornets on that one. You got Murray with the ball to hit. Bogey off a curl. Turn around, fade away, mid range. Got it. Hawks up 19. Hawks up 19. There you go. Good, good job, Bogey. Stay on him. Stay in front. Good contest. Rebound, Murray. Here come the Hawks. Trying to. Push the lead to 21 with a made bucket. 22 with a three. Vic fakes the three. Bogey takes the three. No good. Clint with the board. No. How's that not a foul, bro? How was that? Clint went straight up. Look at all that contact. Like, I, that's what I've been, I've been screaming at all year, bro. They refuse to give us contact off any type of body contact. They refuse to give us these calls, man. Hawks on a 25 to 6 run in the last 630. They refuse to give us calls when it comes with body contact, but they'll give it to the other team on the other end. That's what's been pissing me off all year, dog. Dump it to Clint. Clint up. Power. Thank you. Damn, just go up strong. Hawks up 21. There we go. Good defense by the Hawks. No good. Rebound Clint to Murray. 30 seconds left in the half. He's probably going to run his clock down some. The Murray to Vic. Vic in the lane. And he lost it. He just lost it. So Hornets getting the last shot. Hawks only got four turnovers in a half. That's good, man. That's good. I know we're playing a sorry team, but like I said, this is a team we don't beat, bro. So I mean, we need this. This is this this is a step that we need to be making. Beating team that we should beat. There's no way we should lose to the Hornets, man. Especially without Melo. Seven seconds to go. 
cross court pass for three, and he got it. Who that? Grant Williams. One second left. Just throw it in, man. It's over with. What the hell, Clint? What Clint doing, bro? <laughs> And then Clint, oh my days, Clint was going to shoot that shit. I was wondering why he ain't run his ass down court. He said, I want the ball. I think Murray was really throwing it to somebody else. Okay, they're talking to Bruno. Bruno, the man of the half right now, man. Bruno, 13.4 rebounds. He, per he got 13.4 rebounds in 11 minutes. He perfect from the field today. You perfect for the field of lifting. Listen, listen, I'm going to say it again, man. Tabitha, we got we got to do better with that fit, girl. I ain't feeling that fit you got on today, Tabitha. I ain't feeling the, the little po the polka dots, man. That, that, that look like a dress my mom wears. All right, let me look at these stats, man. Let's see what these stats talking about, broski. All right, let me look at these stats real quick. Mm -hmm. All righty here. Okay, so what do we have here? We have. Okay, Vic. Vic, listen to me. Listen to me. Listen. You cannot play 15 minutes and take one shot, G. Hunter three for eight. We got seven points. Clint with eight. Bogey with nine on amazing shooting tonight. Wow. Murray with 12 on amazing shooting once again. Garrison with nine on great shooting. Bruno with 13 on great shooting. That's the boards. Or Murray at 12.7 rebounds. 12.7. Oh, excuse me. Murray with 12.7 assists and four boards. Okay. Uh, who's leading us in the boards? Looks like Murray is with four. Hawks are. Hawks are plus one on the boards. We're shooting 53% from the field. They're shooting 46. They're shooting 25% from three. We're shooting 38% from three. That three is probably what's the, the uh, what's the make or break right there. It's probably a three point shot right there, man. But um, yeah. I mean, oops. Let me see what they do. Yeah, Bridget was cooking in the first quarter. He cooled down big time. And that's pretty much your threat right there. Everybody on the Hornets are minus. The Hawks are. We got zero on the plus minus. That's negative. So we're looking good. Looking good. Looking good. Looking good. Looking good. So, but yeah, like I said, man, listen. We are going into the plan. What I would hope is I hope that we do a run like the Heat. If we don't, I mean, lottery. But like I'm telling people, man, let's see what we do. I don't think we're going to do any big major move. I don't think we're going to do no major move in the uh, offseason. I really don't think so. Um... But hey, I mean, if they can get a Brandon Ingram, if they can get an all NBA level player here, I'm all for it. You feel me? I'm all for it. But do I believe that's going to happen? No, I don't believe that. Now, if y'all want to believe it, that's cool. If y'all want to believe that, that's cool. That's cool. I don't think so. I think what's going to happen is the same shit. <laughs> that's what I believe. Because, like I said, at the end of the day, if the owner don't want to spend no money, there's no even there's even no use to start to be thinking about going to get any of these guys that that you're gonna to have to pay forty million dollars to. You know what I'm saying? You gotta pay forty million dollars to some of these players. And I'm gonna tell you, man, and like I said earlier, man, you know, I find what's crazy is that 
you know, <clears throat> people want to trade Murray. They saying Murray is not what he was supposed to be. And I'm like, well, you, there's a couple of players we need to throw in that pile too. I mean, DeAndre Hunter. They talking about uh, Herb Jones. And I'm like, isn't that why we drafted uh, Hunter? Ain't that what he's supposed to be doing? Why he not holding up his end of the deal? That fan said that he could defend and do an A, B, C, and D. And ain't never even been mentioned for all defensive team. That's just me, though. That's just me. I'm not I'm not tied to none of these players. Y'all know my motto. To make my team better, I would trade anyone to make my team better. Anyone. I don't care who it is. If, it, if it's going to make my team better, I'm getting what I need in return. I trade. I trade you. I'm not tied to no players, man. Uh, no, no, no. I don't care who the player is. I I will trade their ass. But it got to it got to make my team better. And, and and at this point, nothing makes us better. Nothing. So I mean, not that I think cuz I think we need a legit superstar player in here. Like we need one of those super max guys in here. That's just my opinion. Some people can just they'll disagree with me. That's cool. I have no issue with that. You feel me? But um don't forget to tap in, man. We're going to do the post-game live show tonight, man. Please tap into that after, directly after the game. Um, I'm going to end the stream now because I got to uh, I gotta run my son down the street real quick. We got to do some things. I wanted to catch this first half with the homies because I know I haven't been live streaming for a hot second. Um, but, yeah, I just wanted to come do the stream in the first half just to hang out with fellow Hawk fans. I know the season is disappointing, man. I'm very disappointed. Um, I'm very disappointed in the season. And I mean, right now, like we will be in the play in. It's no ifs, ands, or buts. We will be in the play in. And if we lose that game, we'll be done for the season. If we win the game, we got another game. So, I mean, it is what it is, man. It is what it is. To be honest with y'all, man, like I'm ready for the offseason, bro. I mean, do I really think we could compete with um, some of these powerhouse teams? Hell no. Not for seven games. Not for seven games. We could probably get them for one or two. Not over seven games. We're not going to hang with these top teams, especially if we don't have everybody back. Feel me? But make sure y'all hit that like button, man. We got to get these likes up, man, so we can continue to grow the channel. But I will be back for the um, post-game live show directly after the game make sure y'all tap into that if you're on the lookout for that come hang out let's discuss this game i'll be listening to the game while i'm with my son well i'm gonna be doing both because i i watch it on my phone too shout out to lead pass i watch it on my phone so i'll be watching it on my phone the second half so appreciate for everybody tapping in man i'm gonna catch y'all at the post game live show let me get my son down here because i'm about to be late and we up, we up out of here, man. Y'all stay up, family. Peace.